Hello, we're going to repair this Hisense video and at the same time I'm going to prove to you that I'm absolutely crazy. You may notice on the left hand side, the far left hand of the, se the left hand side of the screen, um, that my shed door is open and it's daylight. Keep your eye on that because that's very important. But in the meantime, Hisense 43, part one of me going crazy is um, not filming the model number of this TV. So I'm sorry, I don't know what the model number is. It just came in from a customer and I normally film the model number and today I didn't. And I don't know why, that's part one of me going crazy. So what I'm doing here at the moment is just taking out the left hand side of the LDVS, oh no that's wrong, LVDS cable. And this is just to ascertain is the short circuit, if it has got a short circuit, if it is a clock line error, is it on the left hand side or is it on the right hand side? And we've proved it is on the side that I've taken it out. So let's just say for argument's sake, it's the left hand side. Even though if you're looking at the screen, it's the right hand side, never mind. So we've got half a picture back. So we've proved that it's, um, it is a, a clock line issue. So then all I have to do, and again, notice, you just notice that door there, slightly ajar. Oh, you can't tell with the lights on, but it is daylight. It is the, this is about four o'clock in the afternoon, so it's just starting to get dark. That's very important in me, need, me needing some medical help in a second. I was going to say mental help, but I think that's true. Um, so I can just see where the clock lines are on that, and I haven't zoomed in enough, and I'm using a HD camera, not a 4K camera, so I'm blocking off the clock lines on the left-hand side, which are normally responsible for this type of fault. Um, if I'm being honest with you, I don't think I've got a hope in hell in fixing this TV, because um, it's not very... It's, I don't get many Hisense in. I think Hisense are quite a cheap brand quite a cheap Chinese brand and um, so I don't get that many in and when something's quite cheap when it goes faulty people tend to throw them away I wish they wouldn't I wish they'd throw them in my direction so I could start earning especially after the Samsung ones we've done of late which you're we're earning nothing from but as you can see from just blocking off the clock lines hey we got the picture back hallelujah and I do double check the picture and it all seems to be fine so it really is a quick fix now you may have noticed um, that I've put the TV back together now and it's still daylight outside but just so th this is really important because in a second here we go you'll see me walk outside I've got no recollection of this by the way and this only happened yesterday and I've gone <laughs> and I don't come back <laughs> And I've only noticed this during the video because when I've turned the PC on today, you'll notice there's an edit in a second and all of a sudden it's pitch black outside. But I've turned the, vi I've turned the PC on to, um, I don't know where I've gone and why I've gone wandering around the park. Somebody help me. I turned the PC on today to do some editing and um, I've noticed that this video is six hours long. I've just left the whole thing going, including the PC. So I haven't filmed the model number and I've just wandered off <laughs> and I don't know why, um, which is really weird. So I couldn't understand why this video was about five and a half hours, six hours long and watching it back, I've just realized that I just walked out and left it for some reason. Anyway, so as you can see, it's dark now, it's nighttime and I've come back in for the nighttime shift because I do two shifts. I tend to do um, uh, an early afternoon and then come back late at night. Where I've gone in the meantime today, I have the faintest idea. Very strange. So I've just come back in to finish it off and put the TV back to uh, get there again. So this is just a quick video on how to fix, if you have lines on your Hisense TV, this should clear it. And it did a really good job. You know, there were no distortions, no lines, no patterns. Everything seems to be back to normal after blocking off that particular set. And, and if you know where I live, by the way, and you've got any idea what I was doing on this day while I was wandering around, maybe I'm some sort of superhero and I don't know it and I got called out to do something. Um, but I wandered off for five hours. Very strange. I'm getting old. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you soon, maybe.